Hey guys, and welcome to today's video. It's going to be a morning routine. It's just a bit of an updated one, I guess, from my last one, which I think was like around last year in the middle of COVID. But anyways, um, I get up every morning around 7, 7.30, depending on when my um, PT session is. This is a day that I did have my PT session. So I think I would have woken up around 7 o'clock. I get up and the first thing I do is obviously go to the toilet, but I'm not going to show you that. And then brush my hair and do my skincare. So I just wash my face, cleanse, and then pop on all of my skincare products. Then I go in my wardrobe and pick my activewear for the day. It's honestly one of the hardest decisions because I've got so many. I decided to go for this Stax one. It's the brown original um, collection. I think it's called Raw Umber actually. So yeah i just decided to wear the strappy crop and then the full length tights love it just chucking on some socks and chucked on a jumper as well because it was freezing this morning um i quickly made the bed and then turned off my lamps and grabbed my apple watch and popped it on and walked to the kitchen where i'm gonna have my morning coffee sometimes i'll have a coffee before i work out sometimes i won't sometimes i'll have pre-workout and if i do i take the naked harvest um sweet strawberry pre-workout but i'm just having a decaf mocha um i don't think i ate anything because usually if i have a coffee i'll eat when i get back um so yeah i'm just making my little coffee And then sometimes I just like to light the candle on my bench. It's from Blossom by Ash. I absolutely love it. While I have my coffee, I just go through Instagram, go through my emails, um, check what I need to do for today. If I've got any sponsored content that I need to post or um, any content that I need to film. I go through people's stories. Um, yeah, I just pretty much just spend the next like 10 or so minutes on my phone. Then I go and grab my shoes from the garage, chuck them on. I've been really loving the Yeezys for the gym. I didn't actually buy them to wear to the gym, but they're actually so comfortable. Here's my little gym outfit. So the top is from Gymshark and then my tights are stacks. And then I hopped into my car and the first thing I do is I plug in my phone and I either listen to a podcast or I just put on my Spotify. Um, it only takes me about 10 or so minutes to get to the gym, but um, yeah, that's just what I do when I get into the car. So then I get to the gym and like I said, I have a PT session with Haley. but first I like to, sometimes I come like 20 or so minutes earlier, just as early as I can come. I'll go warm up on the treadmill and get my steps in. Um, if I can't come earlier, I'll do that after my session, but I got in some steps before and then this is some clips of our lower body workout. So we did some squats, um, RDLs, and then we did some leg press. What was the next one? Um, what are these called? Back extension or glute extension with a plate. And then these are Bulgarian split squats, which is literally my least favorite exercise. They burn. And then in our new program, we've got hip thrust back. I have a love hate relationship with hip thrust. I love the results, but it bloody burns. And then I'm just doing some side clams. By the way, these butterfly booty bands you can get from Jazz Handmade. Um, they're online now. And then here's me driving into my messy driveway. I did pick up something from the post office, but I didn't film it on the way back from gym. Um, it was just a PR box. But first I do need to fulfill last night's orders. Sometimes I do it before the gym. Sometimes I don't have time. So this morning I didn't have time. I woke up a bit later than usual. Um, so yeah, this is just me packing my orders. Doesn't look like I have too many, maybe like 15 or 20, but Usually I can get them done anytime between like half an hour to like 50 or so minutes. It just depends on how big the orders are.
And oh my God, this note was so sweet. Um, this was just after I'd uploaded my vlog. So I only filmed this like maybe two weeks ago, obviously after I'd shared my thoughts on what I've been feeling like and that message really made my day that day. So thank you so much. If you guys leave little notes at the checkout, it really does make my day. So yeah, here's just me packing all of your orders. Honestly, I still find this super satisfying. I actually genuinely love packing your orders. And I love seeing what you guys get. I honestly look forward to it every single day. So then I get my sack and I just put it near the door because I've probably ordered a pickup so they'll come anytime after I call. And now I'm making my brekkie. So I'm just having protein oats and yeah, just adding oats to the pot with some almond milk. I have now switched to water actually. Um, the only reason why I used almond milk was because I didn't really like the Naked Harvest protein with water. But now that I've gotten used to it, I can now mix it with water. So that's what I do now. Um, and then I added some egg whites. I'm just chopping up some strawberries. Because I had a coffee this morning, I am having one of those Avalanche sugar-free drinking chocolates, the white chocolate caramel, I think. It's actually really good. Um, you don't need a lot of water though. Um, if you do mix in more water, it dilutes the taste a bit. So yeah, you don't need a lot of water. And then I just mix in one scoop of protein powder, or well, actually two scoops. Usually I do one, but um, yeah. And then I just mix that in after my oats have cooked. And then I just add all of my toppings. So um, I'll add the strawberries. And I think I've been putting, yeah, I've been putting some sugar-free maple on top and adding some extra almond milk just to make it a little bit more, I don't want to say moist, but like creamy rather than a, like dry. And then I'm just adding some lint chocolate. This is just a 70% smooth blend. And I wait for that to melt. And then, yeah, there is my breakfast. And then while I'm having breakfast, oh, well, before I have it, I obviously have got to snap a photo for the gram, don't I? After I've done that, I then watch people's stories, reply to comments, emails, or whatever um, while I eat. I try to get through as many as I can, but honestly, I probably would get at least, I think, 60 new DMs a day. And it's a lot considering the amount of work I already do, but I do still try to get back to as many of you guys as I can, especially if they're easy questions. Um, so yeah, I do spend a lot of time each day doing that as well as, yeah, like I said, YouTube comments and stuff like that. And then usually I will open up my parcels and I usually vlog it um, in my weekly vlogs, but I got a couple of parcels today. So one of them I'm pretty sure was makeup. And then the other one, I was so confused that I even got this parcel. I'm pretty sure it was from a company called Grey Lines. They've sent me stuff before, but they just came out with Ibis slippers. Like, what do you mean? This isn't an ad, by the way. I have seen a few ads on Instagram, but I was like, what the actual hell? Like, who's going to wear these? Like, they're so ugly. But anyways, thank you so much for sending. I'm not sure what the hell I'm going to do with it, but I was just like, what? What was that? I was not expecting it in the slightest. Um, and yeah, after that, I go and get my little weekly planner. This one's from Steph Pace Planners. It's just like a day-to-day. -day, um, it's just like a very basic daily sort of desk planner. And I just kind of go through all of my reminders and my um, schedule, I guess, on my phone. I just use the reminders app for like literally all of my appointments, all of my content. It's super easy because you get like alerts on your phone when stuff is due. Um, but yeah, I do still like to write everything down, um, put some notes next to it and like just stuff that I need to do that week or that day. And I'll just write it all out. And then I just have that for reference each day. I just like leave it on the counter there. So then I don't miss anything important. And that's pretty much what my morning routine looks like. It's not the most exciting, but yeah, basically what my mornings consist of. Let me know if you guys want to see a nighttime routine or something like that, because I'll happily film it, um, even though it wasn't the most exciting video I've ever filmed. But I guess you guys still like to know what I get up to. Let me know if you guys want to see more of these kinds of videos because I'll be sure to film them. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next week. Bye.